Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to easily get shark anchor. It's probably the best method. And as you can see, I have it right now. I just got it. So stay tuned for that. But I do want to let you guys know I'm giving away permanent fruits to people who like this video. Subscribe and leave a comment down below. As you can see, I have some permanents of my own. I bought sound and mammoth in the previous videos too. And also make sure you guys subscribe for, you know, to not miss out on these methods. Because I showed you guys how to get, um, how to spawn sea beasts in literally 100% chance in the best method. And a lot of you guys said it worked. And it still does work for me actually. And I, you know, I'm hooking myself up with these new drops. But besides that, let's get straight into it. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is come to the new island. As you can see, I'm here. And you wanna to come to the shark hunter where you craft the items and everything right here, right? And what you wanna craft, when you talk to him, you wanna craft and you wanna craft a monster magnet. This is what you need. You need this, all right? If you don't have this, you cannot spawn it. There's no way. The eyes you get from the terror shark, the claws you get from them, them little things that chase you when you ride your boat in the dark area or when you're like around level five or you know something like that five to six they're gonna start spawning you have electric on them and then the gold you get from um ghost ships and the shark teeth you get from like normal sharks that spawn in the water so you're gonna need that if you don't have that you can't spawn anything once you get that you want to get a team of five because you need five people to spawn it you have to have five people on your boat in your party and you want to go sail the sea so that's like the basic stuff that's what you got to know first you want to keep going deep in the sea i think between five and six is where you got to go but now we're going to be talking about when you start fighting it what you should do what's the best way to kill it because you already know the best way to spawn it is just by going and you know it's it's a it's like you got it you just got to spawn it you got to go it's like it's like finding the new island i'd say same thing follow the rocks but if just 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 go straight forward and eventually you'll, you'll run into it but it is a difficult boss but as you see you're gonna see me fight it right here and i know this is the normal terror shark but this is just for an example to show you guys how to fight it because i can actually fight these like more than the actual um 200k health one because those are hard to spawn so this will be the best way to actually show you guys because they're both very very similar and it's just like a 50k health difference and you can see we try to stay in the air whenever we get low we swap right we swap so whenever i get half health or something i jump in the air i hold a move until i heal my partner takes the uh, npc away while i jump back down and start healing and whenever he gets low we swap back and we just keep doing that back and forth unless you know maybe like an error happens where you know we make a mistake but you know as you see i heal i get my health up and once i get my health up i go back in unfortunately one of us died but you know it still did end up working until at the end you know i got hit by my own uh teammate for her because he forgot to ally me but it did work so i'm gonna let y'all see and then after this i'm gonna showcase the sword also make sure you always 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 try to use observation whenever you get it back no hold on hurry hey, up and come back hurry up and come back i'm not even gonna grab it but i'm just gonna use my ice skating yeah we're right here i think that by the new island or is this hydra i don't know i don't know what it looks like no it's it's like my haunted castle-ish. Okay. I think. Bro, it's oh, literally right. Right. It's right behind Tiki Alpha. Does it despawn after you attack, after it breaks the ship, or? No, no, it doesn't. Mm, I think until everyone dies, it despawns. Yeah, no, no, here, it doesn't, so. it doesn't, it doesn't. It doesn't despawn go. at all. Okay, okay, I gotta, I'm gonna, I'm gonna heal, bro. I'm gonna heal, cause I'm Just not- watch out, though, cause if it grabs you, you're dead. I know, Where's he's coming that? towards me. I see, I see. Hurry up, hurry up. I'm about to kill it. Wait, I'm about to kill it. No way. Come on. Oh, chill. Kill it. Oh, oh I oh, died. You killed me. You're selling. I was about to kill it, too. <laughs> What's that shiny one, too? Um. Uh, that means you can get the anchor. That has to be 100, like, 90k health, right? Uh, you should get it. I think, yeah, it needs 700. 90 kill, and you still have the anchor, the anchor on the oh side of the ship. Oh my god, I'm about to die. Okay. I'm ready. Alright, I got it, I got it, I got it. Just keep running, just keep running. Alright. Oh my god. Ain't no way CB's just gone. Oh man. You good? I got you. We got it. Come on, go, go. Bam, spam, 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 spam. Oh, I died. 10,000, no. 10,000 helps. 7,000. There we go. I got mutant tooth. Nice, nice, nice. There we go. All right. Now we get the showcase. All right. So, boom. All right. So, first, we got Siphon Toss. All right. With Siphon Toss, you can actually hit like an extra time if you aim towards the next thing. Like, watch. I'll hit this. 
Yeah, see, I hit that next NPC. They're both flying. You can aim this and actually hit multiple people. So that's really OP. So let's use it. Let's use that one more time. And you can, if you just hold it down, you can same thing. You could just collect people. And it the, the longer you hold it down, the the huger the AOE gets. So let's sit here. Let me wait for the cooldown. If I just tap it once, the AOE is gonna be super small. Watch this. This is very small. That's very small. But if I hold it down, it's uh it, it's you know bigger AOE, obviously, man. Bigger range, blah 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 blah. I'm just yapping right now. But yeah, hold it down, bigger AOE, you can aim it. It's a really, this is a really cool weapon, though, I'm not gonna lie. Especially the animation. All right, next we have Armor Breaker. With Armor Breaker, it's just like a, you aim it and you, you just, it's like a slash. You just hit them and you slash them up. You can you probably like combo extend with this. And hey, watch. Boom. I'm pretty sure it kind, kind of, it kind of auto tracks. I'm not gonna lie. Watch, I'm gonna aim this. Boom. Hit the, damn! Where it's like, you could just like knock them over like stones, like rocks, man. All right, let me get this again. Let's get a uh, NPC with more HP. This this has really good range too. This is really good range. I think that you can honestly probably use that as like a mobility or something. You know what I'm trying to say? As an extra mobility. But this weapon, 100% would be really good with like, you know, God Human or something. You could just like, you could soar in, switch to the weapon, right? Armor Breaker. All right, I, I didn't aim that right, but you could Armor Breaker and then Siphon, grab them in, right? Throw them away. You see, look at that. Like you could do some serious damage, some serious combos with this. But let me see how far this goes. Hold on. All right, that's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. That's pretty good range. It auto tracks if anyone's even near you. I'm pretty sure it has a like, really big AOE here. Hold on. Let me um all the way over here. Let me let me not even. I'm gonna I'm gonna make it come towards me, but aim like over there. Watch. Let me try. Okay. Well, I mean, if you aim it in the direction. You'll, you'll most likely hit it, but let me do this one more time. This is so sick. That's so sick. And it does like extra hits. It's like three hits or something. So that's really good damage. But let's try to do some combos with this or something. Let me uh let me go to the boss back there. Right, let's run up to this dude. Also, let me know what you guys think about this method. And let me know what you guys think about this sword. Because it is amazing, man. So let me try to do some combos right here, man. Let me check off my observation hockey so you guys can kind of see. Where'd he go? But I can't see. All right, boom. All right, hit him with this. Uh, you know, if you guys know any combos, let me know in the comments down below. I will read them and I will try them in the next video, bro. So hook me up, bro. Boom, right? Okay. Y'all? Y'all? Dodge that. Come in with this. Come here. Drop down. As soon as he dropped down, throw him away. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Yo! Complain me. Them is combos right there. Them is combos. Combos. This is the end of the video. Also, don't forget about that giveaway. It's going to be ending pretty soon. I won't be doing a lot. So you want to make sure you hop in when you can. And also, it should be the next video. Next video is going to be really, really crazy. I want y'all to see that, man. So be excited for that. Besides that, y'all stay safe, stay healthy. I will see y'all in the next one.